further pressure on this issue. And we've seen a lot of extra pressure today, including from the European Union, from their Commissioner for Humanitarian Aid, uh, Kristalina Georgieva. This is what she has said. What started as a human rights crisis is now rapidly slipping into a very serious humanitarian catastrophe. And again, I just want to stress, the humanitarian community can put the plaster on the wound. We cannot treat the underlying causes. This requires political determination and engagement that can turn the course of events. Right now, it looks really bad. Okay, and just to update us as well, what's the news from Homs where, of course, Marie Colvin and a French photographer killed yesterday? The situation there, from all the reports we're getting, is still very serious. Shelling resumed today by government forces uh, on unarmed civilians all over Homs. Uh, there have been huge numbers of casualties there, and I think people will be distressed to know that so far it's proved impossible uh, to bring out the bodies of Marie Colvin and the French photographer with her. It's simply too dangerous. The British and French are trying very hard to recover those bodies, but haven't been able to do so yet. Okay, James, thank you. Profits at British Gas have fallen by almost a third to £522 million, despite the company who's been so cut his last year. UK's biggest energy supplier blamed the drop on the mild weather and improvements in efficiency. In 2010, temperatures passed as households turned up the heating, gas demand soared, and so did profits of British gas. In 2011, it turned out to be one of the worst years on record. And that's not bad for the Russians, the UK's biggest energy supplier. Looking at the bark here, the, uh, the cracks and fissures in the Hyperion are very vertical, very long, very straight. Not as gnarly as uh, a lot of the other trees we've seen. Width-wise, it's still absolutely colossal, but again, not quite as big as some of the titans we've seen. Having said that, it's still over 11 foot, 12 foot wide where I'm hanging. <laughs> so it is not a tree to be trifled with. 